And I am going to share the screen and get us started from the beginning rather than in the middle. And there we go. All right, so we wanna welcome you this evening to our All Things Holiday. We are pretty excited about all of the holiday products that Young Living has to offer this year. However, those, while we are waiting for them to be able to be purchased starting November 9th, not only are we going to fill you in on those, we're going to give you some ideas of some things that you can do in the meantime and some fun activities and some ways that you can do some self-care as well. So the great thing is that whether you are looking for a gift for her, a gift for him, for kids, for friends, for the home, for stocking stuffers, we've got you covered with this year's Young Living Holiday Guide. And as I said, we've got some fun things in store for you. The nice thing too is that we have every budget covered. So whether you're looking for a gift that's under 50 or somewhere between 50 and 100 or a little over 100, we've got you covered there as well. And so we wanna be able to have this as always be a resource guide for you. So afterwards you are going to get this resource guide or this presentation as a resource guide. And you have all the information that we share tonight in that. So don't worry too much about needing to take notes and catch every single little thing. We're just gonna have a fun conversation tonight and fill you in and you will have this to use as a resource later on. So I am going to turn this over. Yes, that's for me. Thank you. Okie dokie. <laughs> and I'm going to be talking about gifts for her, for all the hers that are on your list. We got something from for, just for everyone here. And first of all, we have these adorable earrings. Now these earrings are made from jewelry makers in old Delhi, India. No idea there was an old, knew there was a new. But, and they combine their profits and they sponsor the education for girls in their community, which I love. This also comes with a bottle of joy. Let me tell you, I thought I was reaching for RC and I grabbed the joy for some reason. I don't like joy. It's not my favorite. And I put it on my chest and I was like, oh, that smells wonderful. What is it? I turned on the light, joy. So in other words, do not give away your oils. If you don't like the scent, you will, trust me, someday you're gonna grab it and go, oh my gosh, how did I live without this? So that is, um, however, most women wear joy as their perfume. So, um, and then next is the, um, whoop, hi, <laughs> let's see. Nope, I'm still on her. Sorry. So, <laughs> and um, the vanilla mint, just the sound of that sounds amazing. So it's got the vanilla scent with the tingling sensation of the peppermint to keep your skin glowing all winter long. And then next they have the brand new, this is just so cool, <laughs> luxurious blend of CBD and rose essential oil. Okay, that's amazing for your skin, especially during the winter months when things are so, so dry. Now it does come with an eye mask, but only while supplies last. But if you need it, I mask, just email me, I'll get you one. Not one of these kitties, but I got one for you. And next is the, um, I really love this one too. You know, guys, I just love everything. So just know that I love everything. Um, of the, um, this, these uh, turquoise necklaces and bracelets are made um, by women of the Navajo Nation. 
and they're they come with um turquoise or frosted with amazonite stones haven't heard of that lava beads and sterling silver and it makes it uh, the lava beads, especially when you drop the oil on them, makes a great diffuser all day long. 100% of these proceeds benefit the Young Living Foundation. So a lot of these um, gifts this year, you can look good, you can smell good, well, you do good. So lots there. The next is the Holiday Kisses Lip Balm. How many people put these in your kids' stocking? every single year. Yeah. <laughs> How many people get them in their stocking every single year? Yep, most definitely. Um, but each lip balm features hydrating botanical blends and it locks in the moisture. So you will always be mistletoe ready. Sometimes you don't want to be mistletoe ready, but you will be mistletoe ready. And these lip balms are great as a primer before lipstick. Really does a great job keeping your lipstick on. And the Olive Wood Giving Grove Collection. Now I have so many things in my house that are olive wood from Jerusalem when I was in Israel. Uh, 99 and so just the feel of olive wood olive wood is so smooth and when you hold it it's it's just what is it it brings you back to the garden of gethsemane let's put it that way um and then these are great with the evergreen essence Drop, dropped on it Dropped on them and then it just permeates your home. I kind of like to, um, I think I'm gonna put these around my nativity set. Kind of set it up behind my nativity set. So I think that would be a really good idea. And then boop, drops them on every couple days. Um, let's see, the Christmas foaming spirit. Okay, Christy, you probably should have been talking about this because she bought out the entire inventory last year at Young Living. Nobody else could get Christmas spirit foaming hands out because Christy bought all of it. <laughs> so, <laughs> she I'm guilty. It. I bought a lot. I love <laughs> it. I bought the refill because they had a refill last year. Mm. I it smells so good. That is great. It has orange and cinnabar and blue spruce essential oils. And Christy, were you able to make two or three bottles out of that one? Okay. So in my newsletter, I put uh, a link to some pretty bottles, pump bottles. So you can make three gifts out of this one, one purchase right here. Let, whoop, I don't know what happened to that. Um, and what's that? Oh, the Northern Lights Farm Collection. I've lost my notes. So I'm going to wing it and say these are from um, Canada. These oils are all distilled from trees in Canada. And it's a very special place, was a very special place in Gary's heart. Uh, because he was raised in Canada. So he was always just, you can just see him bloom when it was time to distill these oils. Um, Julie, I love the idea of taking these oils as well because there are four in this collection and breaking them up for separate gifts, either for stocking stuffers or <clears throat> for making them a part of multiple gifts for, for the guys in your life. Oh, that's perfect. Yes. And all of these oils, men just feel so manly. Yeah. Julie, I'm going to go ahead and read this because it ties into one of your products. So there was a question about the CBD beauty boost. Okay. And so Right now, the only people that have tried those are the Young Living Diamonds, and we don't have product information sheets to read from yet. So um, 
I am just going to read a short summary from oh, one of the you. diamonds that okay. tried it. Um, so she said, I've literally been obsessing over this Rose CBD Beauty Boost since the second I saw it. I can't really put into words how cosmic it feels with the Bloom facial set. But suffice to say, if you need me, I'll be over here washing my face all day long. She's going to send it to her friends with the rose quartz roller, the face roller, and a homemade rose misting spray, which we may have to get back to people on because I'm not sure what that looks like, but that sounds divine. Um, so that's how she is using it and has wonderful things to say about it. So that was all. I was trying to do a quick research to get some additional information. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, it's going to be um, so amazing, especially in the winter months, for sure. So next we are going to, we have a new owl diffuser, and it's called the Snowy Owl Diffuser. It runs the same way as our Feather the Owl Diffuser. Um, it has, uh, it's an all-in-one humidifier, which is great for our membranes in the winter and when the heat is on. Uh, night light and a white noise machine and you touch their, his little talons and that's how you turn on the sound machine and lights. It's so cute, kids love it. Um, but it is a limited edition. And most likely the stickers that come with it will come separately. So oh. they do have little snowflake stickers and sunglasses and all that kind of thing. Do not be surprised if those arrive separate from your order. Very good, thank you. And it also includes Kid Power and the Kid Sense Sleepy Eyes, Sleep Eyes. So excellent, excellent oils to go with that diffuser. And um, next, I just love these little, these little Polar Pal Thieves collection. They cover your Thieves hand sanitizers. And these are great for also stocking stuffers. And um, the little bottles fit right into these um, portable, I don't know what I'm trying to say, but anyway. They're really adorable. So my husband has the owl because his name is Alfred. So he called his owl friend, just so you know. And <laughs> so, oh, and by the way, we can call our hand purifier actually sanitizer. We are allowed to say that now because it has been proven to kill 99. 99% of the germs. So I was really, really excited about that. And then the kids roll on collection. If you've got kids, if you've got grandkids, if you've got nieces, if you've got nephews, you're going to want to divide these sets up and at least give them one or two, if anything. And then the um, three pack dream catcher bath bombs. I'm really hoping these are as big as they look. I'm not sure because um, the other bath bombs are so big, you cut them in half because, and then it's double that you I can use them. I saw Tammy use one this week and they're pretty big. It oh, that's good. So, mm -hmm. so you might want to mention to the person that you're giving it to that cut them in half and They'll double their bubbles for this winter. Okay. So as you'll see here, my first item is also talking about the, the dream catcher. Our whole thing here is just kind of saying, should, try, trying to kind of show you how you can gift these out and keep one for yourself, give two away for your friends. I love our bath bombs. If you haven't used any of them yet, I love that they're not full of fake dyes and all of that stuff they're they're fantastic and i am sure most of you are super excited for the vanilla i know i about fainted when i saw we were finally getting vanilla because i'm asked for it all the time 
It's gonna smell amazing. You can do it. You can put it in your bath. You can do diffuser recipes with it, Epsom salts, any, basically anything you want. We're asked all the time if we can cook with it. It's not a vitality. So we're gonna say no, <laughs> but it's not like a vanilla bean. So I just wanna be clear. It's not like a vanilla bean. It comes from the resin of the orchid plant. So it's gonna be a little bit different, but I can't wait to smell it myself. It's gonna be amazing. The next option is the cute little mug that you can get with our very popular turmeric spiced tea, which is my favorite of our teas. Um, and that's a great little gift for your tea lover. You can even open up that tea and gift them out. I think there's 12 sachets in there. So you could give somebody three, 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 you know, whatever you wanted to do. It would be a great little gift. And then we have a diffuser bracelet, which as Julie talked about the sister necklace earlier, same kind of things, but it's just another piece of jewelry that you could gift out. Okay, so I'm super excited about this page because I love all things thieves. And that caddy, I know you can't see it very well in this picture, but you guys look it up. It is a super cute caddy and it comes with the thieves laundry and it comes with empty bottles. I believe they're empty, correct me if I'm wrong, um, for you to make fabric softener, a stain remover, a linen spray, and it comes with five hanger rings. So if you see that little round disc that's kind of by the, the laundry soap, you can put your favorite smelling oil on there and put it on your hangers and it's gonna make your closet just smell amazing. I'm so excited to get those. Or pop one in a drawer, pop one in your, your sweater drawer or whatever, you, there's, you could use them so many different ways. Um, okay, I wish I had more information on this, but this New Haven diffuser is so cool if you ask me. It's smaller, but it does have four diffuser settings, but I don't know what they are. I don't know what the times are yet, um, but it's made of a clay and it's like um, a cream eggnog type color. Comes with vanilla, comes with Christmas spirit. I can only imagine what those two oils are gonna smell like together. Um, and again, they have a holiday foaming hand soap collection. The thieves we all know and love. And again, you could get 369 gifts out of this because you can dilute these and put them in your own foaming hand soap dispenser. And it'd be a great, very affordable gift to hand out to people. And it'll give you a taste of all three. You can get thieves, you get the Christmas spirit and the new winter, is it nights, lights? Andrea, I keep getting messed up like you did. <laughs> but I can't wait. And the diffuser ball, or diffuser balls, listen to me. The dryer balls, we all know dryer balls are great. It's part, been part of our laundry hacks and everything. These are handmade in Nepal. They are dye-free wool dryer balls and they will go, they'd be a great gift too. Like I, I would keep them for myself, <laughs> but that's because I'm selfish sometimes. But they're a great gift to go along with say the caddy or if you look to the right, you can see we have these new little laundry bags too. They are a little small. They would be great to maybe put your delicates in and keep some purification on there and help things keep smelling good until you go to wash them. But again, those are gonna be, you could give, the, give those, any of these would be great for anybody. And again, stocking stuffers. <laughs> those uh, bath bombs are very popular. <laughs> Actually, everything on here we've already talked about. So this is just another idea to give you for stocking stuffers. Break up those into three. You could get a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve 12 gifts. Right there. Easy. Wow. That's me. Okay, I think this is one of the, okay. It's a little hard to pick the best thing in the holiday kit because like it'd be a hard choice between a bottle of vanilla or this kit. I know, right? Um, I, I mean, you can read what's in it every, oh, 
I'll go ahead and run through it in case the print's not big enough. Um, lemon, lab, they're all five mLs. Uh, lemon, lavender, peppermint, thieves, frankincense, joy, peace and calming, bergamot, grapefruit, and the thieves hand sanitizer, uh, the cutest carrying case ever, and the sweet aroma diffuser. Now I have seen the sweet aroma setting beside the Haven and the Haven is a little bit smaller than the sweet aroma. Um, I like the sweet aroma in my bathroom. Um, I think it, it, I think either one of them would be great for a bathroom diffuser or an office diffuser um, or a travel diffuser. Um, those cases are a great, they add a great value to this kit. Um, I have a diffuser case. It is not that one, um, but simply you just unzip them and your diffuser sets right in it and it packs it so nicely for travel. Um, it takes up a lot less room when you're, you know, just putting it in a case just its size. All right, let me look at the notes here. So you need to know that people can, oh, I wasn't quite done with that slide. Um, so one of the things that is different about this product than some of the other products um, is that people can actually enroll and get a Young Living membership with this kit, um, or they can reactivate, or we as current members can order this kit but it is a limited time only. And I am going to guess this is going to be a very, very popular product that sells out pretty quickly. Um, and you know, you could also break that apart if you wanted to buy it and gift it, you know, that way. Um, but personally, I think it'd be awesome even for a little gift for yourself. Those are fabulous oils. Um, I think that is a great price on that kit. Um, so super, super excited to see that. The nice thing right. too with that, Marsha, is that yes. if someone, <clears throat> excuse me, if someone has not, for instance, signed up their spouse yet, they could always sign up their spouse with this kit. And as long as you have a 50 PV order of your own that month, you get $50 for enrolling your spouse. So it becomes like a $50 rebate on this. And the overall cost of the gift is $100 instead of 150. So it's a, it's a great way to think about that. Or if you're gifting it um, to a sister or to your mom and you're enrolling them and using this as their, you know, their essentially their premium starter kit, um, you'll get the $50 back. So it's really bringing the cost of that gift down even more so for you. Yep. And same if you're gifting it for your kids. Um, anybody 16 and older can sign up for a membership. All right. So this will be handy when you go back through. I know it's a little hard to read up on the screen, but this will be helpful as you're making your list. So here are the important things that you need to know about that. Everything is a limit one, except for the KidSense roll-ons. They have a limit of two. Um, the Christmas Spirit hand soap um, in the singles has no limit. So if you wanna be like Christy and be a Christmas Spirit hoarder, I said hoarder, um, or whatever you wanna fill in there, um, Christmas Spirit hoarder, you can order as many as you want. And I've heard it's great all year long. Uh, I have to share about the vanilla mint lip balm. So my daughter loves vanilla mint lip balm and she has been trying to stretch it out until Christmas because I've discovered that two for the year is not enough. So it's important that you buy enough an element lip balm to last you through the year. And I'm just saying you might want to gift the other ones to other people and keep that vanilla mint to yourself. You may not want to hook any family members on the vanilla mint lip balm because I will say 
The vanilla mint lip balm has never touched my lip because the kid took it before I ever got any. So um, on one of the diamonds said that um, she has a lip balm stash and she said, not this kind of stash. Um, she buys like 15 to 20 of the sets to last her through the year. So there is no limit on the lip balm. So those are fantastic gifts. And I would say, I, I think it's like an unsung hero in Young Living. Like once you use their lip balm, all other lip balms pale in comparison. Um, and, you know, I have a college student, so they use like all the different products. And she's begging me for the Young Living Vanilla Mint Lip Balm. So um, definitely, definitely stock up on those. That's also another really good reason. Now, Marsha's telling us that there's no limits on those lip balm sets, but other sets that is a limit of one, um, that's another really good reason to have that spouse account or you know, you have your kids' accounts as well so that you can talk to them and say, hey, can you go ahead and place that order for me? And I will be happy to cover that. Um, but at least that way you can get your hands on more than your limit of one with your personal membership. Um, you know, get your spouses and all that kind of good thing. And I echo what Marsha was saying about that lip balm. I will tell you a story when we stop recording. I also love that they have the limits because it's less of a rush. It's less of a, I don't feel like, oh my gosh, I have to do it right this second. Like obviously they're still going to probably sell out because there's limited supply, but I love that somebody can't come in and buy all of the things. <laughs> so I love that they did limits this year. I, I thought that was a good addition. I agree. And I will say that, um, products, particularly ones that are artisan made, like when these are gone, they're gone. We're not going to be able to replace them. So when they're saying that they are limited time only, because some of these are a part of our permanent products moving forward, such as the vanilla, but other things like the winter nights, that is right now currently not going to be a part of our permanent offering. So you want to get yours now. Um, and if you can get others through other accounts, get your stash now to last you through, uh, because once they're gone, they are gone. And I would say, you know, if you're budgeting or you need to figure out um, how to spread your items out over several months, it's important to know which products are permanent. So the vanilla is a permanent product. So if it, if it sells out, it will come back. Um, so if you're trying to pick and choose what to order, um, you can always put that off and add in something else that is going to sell out. The Haven Diffuser is a permanent product, but it won't permanently come with Christmas spirits and vanilla. So I'm guessing they probably have a first run batch of the Havens that are paired with the Christmas spirit and the vanilla. And then once those sell out, they'll pair it with some other oils in the future. Um, and then the other product is that CBD Beauty Boost. And I am sure it will sell out in the initial run, um, but it will come back eventually. All right, so let's talk about how to order. So Young Living's been tweaking their website and what we hear, and I can guarantee you there will be some kind of changes as we go along, but we will keep you updated on whatever those are. But the most current information really as of a couple of hours ago was that we should be able to order these products on November 9th. And the couple of things you need to know about that is you will need to log into your account, or if you've set up a spouse account or a kid's account, whichever account you're using to order from, or both, you are going to go into the shop section. 
right now, these cannot be added to essential rewards. I don't know if they will be ever allowed to add into essential rewards. Most likely by the time they even allow that, they've sold out. So if you want these products, you need to go ahead and log in whenever it's available on the night, go into the shop section, um, and then you're going to go under the new and featured and look for the 2020 YL holiday launch. All right, so I think, and then um, we'll make sure that we on all of our pages, keep it updated as to the latest information. If you want us to include you in that on a personal message, just let us know that you're waiting to order and we'll make sure that we keep you in the loop personally on that information. So this is where I get to jump in and I'm excited about it because we're gonna have a little bit of fun. So we figured we've got some time before we can order, but this gives us great time to plan, right? So why not make your planning fun and make a batch of this rosemary popcorn? Now, if you are not a rosemary fan, you could do it with lime, you can do it with basil or dill or cinnamon. I love the rosemary flavor at the fall time. So whether you are figuring out your gift giving list or you're watching a new Christmas movie, I meant to put in the Hallmark schedule for you guys. I, the Hallmark schedule will be put in here for you before you get this. So you will get the Hallmark Christmas movie schedule for both their stations. And, you know, maybe you're cheering on your favorite football team. Make this. It is a really great, healthy alternative for something um, savory and salty to enjoy. And it is gone in our house whenever we make it. So start with making some rosemary popcorn. Then if you want a little project to do, I've got a couple of project ideas. This one is slightly more involved, but really not that big of a deal. I've actually made these and they're very cool. Now here's my tip for you. You want to make sure that you are using these in your outdoor fire pit, okay? So this is not for indoor fireplaces. This is for outdoor. So you're going to uh, just take your pine cones. You will have, you know, you're out hiking, right? Go out and go hike. Go find your favorite pine cones. Julie said that if you find one that's still on the, on the branch, you can, and they're closed up, you can leave them in your garage for a couple of days and they open up beautifully. So find all of your favorites and then follow the directions for melting down some wax and adding in your favorite essential oils, whether it's Christmas spirit or just cinnamon or clove. Uh, maybe you wanna do peppermint, anything. I, any of the tree oils, those are great too. Bring out more of that um, pine kind of scent. But you're gonna use these then, once they dry and have had that time to do their thing, you can store them and be able to pull them out as fire starters. So you'll literally light uh, one of the scales of the pine cone and it will light up and grab hold for longer because it's covered in wax and help you with starting your outdoor bonfires. So fun little project to do and it can be a great little gift for somebody. If you're looking for something unique and you've got people who love to do their outdoor fires, why not make a batch of these and have it smell really yummy for them. Now, if you are one who prefers indoors. These are not intended to be used as fire starters, but you can use them as decorations. And I have done these before as well, and they work so well. I don't know about y'all, but when I walk into Kroger and I walk past the section that has those cinnamon fragranced brooms in them, it's so overwhelming to me because it is the fake fragrance. And I have a really hard time with that. And so what I have done is I use pine cones and I follow these directions. If you want to, you can add in cinnamon sticks, you can add in dried orange peel, you can add in um, eucalyptus leaves, 
you want to do that. I have a friend who actually grows eucalyptus in her backyard. So cool. I want a eucalyptus tree. Um, so I can do that. But you can scent these with your favorites. Again, choose what you'd like to do. Your Christmas spirit, your cinnamon bark, your um, Northern Lights black spruce, any of those kinds of things. But you're going to store these for one week to four weeks. So this is a great project to do now while you're waiting to place your order, while you're waiting to do some of your other Christmas things, like get this done now and you can put it out in your home, either put it in a basket or last year what I did was I strung the pine cones on twine and I hung them from my mantle and I hung them over uh, the tops of my windows. And it makes for such a great festive atmosphere and then you have the wonderful fragrance of the oils kind of diffusing throughout your house. So this is a super, super easy DIY. If you are not a big DIYer, this one is like no brainer. You can do this, I promise. So another thing that's really important to think about during the holidays and as we prep for the holidays coming is that we take care of ourselves, which we are often the ones that we think of last, right? So I honestly just wanted to give you a few ideas to remind each one of us of ways that we can take care of us and be the best us that we can be for our families and friends or friends throughout the holiday season. So whether you are practicing mindful breathing or adding citrus oil to your water, reading a good book, taking a bath with some Epsom salts, which I don't even think I put in here on this list, but baths with the Epsom salts and oils are one of my very favorite things to do. So you need, if, if I'm needing relaxation, you'll find me in the tub. Um, so another great thing that you can do with that, grab your RC if you're going for a walk and apply that beforehand because you have a little bit easier breathing. Maybe try a new recipe that you've never tried. And Christy's going to give you some amazing ones next week on our webinar. So you'll be able to incorporate some of those new recipes and you know, try something new, see what you think. So there's some ideas here for you to kind of look through and just jog your memory and we'll probably get you thinking about some other things, but we just want you to remember you during this time. And y'all, holidays with family can sometimes be a challenge, just being real. You know, we all would love things to look absolutely perfect and peaceful and wonderful, but sometimes they're not, right? And people are people and there's been a lot this year. And so get in the habit now of doing the great day protocol with Gary's oils um, for the feeling, you know, from the feelings kit and outside of the kit actually too. There's a couple from the feelings kit and a couple from the outside. But Great Day Protocol, Valor, Joy, Harmony, and White Angelica. I put this one in here. I really like it because there's an affirmation and then there's a declaration that's a scripture verse in there. But if that's not your thing, you don't have to do that. Just a really great thing to remember to do for a way that you can apply some very specific oils to help support emotional health and well being during the season. And it is always, always, always a good idea throughout the year to um, diffuse for the atmosphere being merry and bright, right? And if you um, anticipate there might be some bumps in your family time together, grab some Harmony now because it is a wonderful oil to diffuse during family gatherings. Um, you can pair it with something else like Stress Away or a Citrus Fresh, anything like that, but it's just a really great one to add into your blend. Um, put it in with Believe and get some of the sprucey aspects of Believe and of the season um, put together with your harmony. And it was a, it's a really great combination. Little bit of self-care ideas here as well. DIYs, okay? The pumpkin mask is luxurious on your face and hey, it's pumpkin. Perfect for the fall season. Uh, so grab your pumpkin. Hopefully you don't have a shortage where you are and, or do what we did, get a fresh little sugar pumpkin and you can cook that up and make your own pumpkin puree. You don't have to buy it from the can. They didn't buy it from the can back in the pioneer days, right? So we don't need to buy it from the can either. 
Uh, you can do a mistletoe lip scrub. There's a great recipe there and that is fantastic for exfoliating your lips. Wanna talk for just a second about this dry shampoo. This is a recipe that I have made that I use regularly. This is a mama's best friend, particularly through the holiday season. That's why I wanted to include it here. We're, we're gonna bring it back around probably on our bathroom hacks uh, next month, but had to bring it up here because this refreshes your hair so beautifully. And so if you are needing some extra time and you don't have the time to like, you know, it, it takes longer, right? To wash and dry our hair straight and whatever. So just use this DIY dry shampoo. It is a godsend. It's awesome. And what I will do is I will, uh, you can sprinkle it in if you want to. You're going for the roots. You're not going so much for the ends, go for the roots. Um, I have used a brush, like a, an old makeup brush, and I kind of brush it in there because I didn't have a shaker thingy. Plus it, it helps me be more specific with where I want to apply it. And I will wrap my hair in a towel and take a shower and when I come out, I'll just kind of shake it out into the bottom of the shower and then I brush it through and it's fantastic. It will save you so much. So make your batch now, put the cocoa in it if you are dark hair, um, definitely makes a difference. Then take care of yourself by ending your day well, either with a cup of one of our Young Living teas. We've got vanilla lemongrass, we have orange rose hip, or we do have the spice turmeric, which we already talked about as part of our holiday catalog. Uh, but you can go ahead and get those ahead of time separately from the holiday catalog. Or if you are looking for more of an adult beverage, this is a favorite for me in our house. So I thought I would share it with you. Uh, it is a hot toddy with a drop of Thieves Vitality in it. So you are kind of supporting your immune system at the same time. And uh, just a very sweet, gentle way to end the evening if you would like to do it with an alcoholic beverage. Then when your order does come, you are going to want to have these amazing diffuser combinations to use with your vanilla essential oil. I mean, come on, vanilla chai latte, root beer float, sugar and spice, I mean, Yes, please and thank you. So there are six different diffusing combinations there for you to try. And um, I would love to know in the comments which one you are most excited about. Vanilla Dreams, Sweater Weather, Tropical Creamsicle, Vanilla Chai Latte, and I have a, a chai tea every morning, so I will probably go with that. Root Beer Float or the Sugar and Spice. So what do you think? Put it in the comments because I would love to know. Last but not least, next week, we want to make sure that you guys know that we are going to be jumping back on here at 8 p.m. on Wednesday night. And Christy has told us that she does not use a single dried herb in her holiday cooking. I am so excited about this because I want to learn all of her tips for being able to do my entire holiday meal with Young Living Vitality Oils. Super, super excited. So yes. I am going, go ahead. Sorry, I had to take the dog out real quick. I'm so sorry. Oh, but you're yes, good. I'm, exci I'm excited for this class too. It's gonna be a lot of fun. So super, super excited about that. All right, so I am stopping sharing. I am going to stop recording after saying thank you so much for, in, for joining us this evening. And we are going to pause then for a Q&A. Andrea, wait just a second. Leave it on recording for just one second, please. Oh, so um, stay in recording? Yeah, I wanted, I had found some more information about the CBD Beauty Boost. Okay. So I'll, I'll read it real quick. Um, so the key ingredients are of course CBD, rose oil and tamanu, is that the correct pronouncing? It's T-A-M-A-N-U, A-N-U, yeah, tamanu, um, and grape seed. So um, we're all familiar with the rose, great for the skin. Uh, and apparently the CBD is supposed to be awesome for the skin as well. 
and the tamanu is a nutty rich in fatty acid sorry i'm trying to read it off my phone and i didn't grab my glasses so give me just mm -hmm. a second and it's also supposed to uh, uh, improve the appearance of skin and even out the skin tone so Awesome. Thank you so, so much, Marsha. Really appreciate you sharing that with us. Anything else for the recording? Okay, so I'm going to stop the recording. Hang on just a moment, please. <laughs>